The famous Rose Parade in Pasadena, California, includes marching bands, horses, exotic cars, and features high-tech computerized floats. Each float must conform to certain regulations. The entire surface must be covered using only natural material, including a variety of flowers, seeds, bark, and leaves. Each float is decorated with more flowers than the average florist will use in five years. This is a bald eagle. It is a species unique to North America. The bald eagle was officially declared the national emblem of the United States in 1782. Hey, how do you know about this? A little bird told me. This little bird means a secret or private source of knowledge. Shh, bye. Shh. Hummingbirds are native only to the Americas. They are known for their ability to hover in midair by rapidly flapping their wings 15 to 80 times per second. The hummingbird has the ability to fly deliberately backwards. This is the only group of birds able to do so, or vertically and to maintain position while drinking nectar or eating tiny arthropods from flower blossoms. They are named for the characteristic hum made by their wings. A bird in the hand is worth two in the bush. This saying means it's better to have a small actual advantage than the chance of a greater one. Ah, some very cute orange and yellow baby ducklings with their mother. Ducks can elude their enemies in many ways, either by flying, running, swimming, or diving for cover. Therefore, they are a symbol for a resourceful person. Let's be like ducks and lead the way. Swans. These birds symbolize grace, healing, transformation, spiritual evolution, dignity, loyalty. The phrase swan's song means a final farewell. A viewer asks, where does the phrase flipping the bird come from? To give someone the bird means to dismiss them, although this definition makes no mention of a hand gesture. I won't use the hand gesture, but you know what it is. It would be inappropriate for me to show you. A penguin is a water bird that can't fly. Many penguins live in the icy waters in Antarctica. I highly recommend the film March of the Penguins. It's amazing. You will enjoy learning about this great animal in the world we live in. Mother Goose is a well-known figure in the literature of fairy tales and nursery rhymes. Hey, meet my friend here. Isn't he cute? Hello. Hello. Meet my other friend. Hello. Hello. Birds of a feather flock together. This saying means people who are a lot alike tend to gather together and become friends. Just like these guys, they're friends, see? Well, we're all friends. We are birds of a feather flocking together. The white dove has long been a symbol of love and peace, building a peaceful society, a peaceful world. The dove is visionary, forever looking forward, flying forward towards a future of peace. Notice the colors on this bird. Notice the texture as we get in closer. Look at the red texture. 
Seaweed is used to create the color of black. Another name for bird is fowl. I believe I'm in the mood for some fowl. Look, 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 there goes some fowl. Yes, that's nice. Sounds nice. You'll never use it. Never. Bye-bye.